Hi everyone, I'm Drew with Mobility Direct and today I'm going to be showing you how to replace the horn on your mobility scooter or you can call it a buzzer. In this case we have one that's a little bit faulty. So you go to turn it on. It beeps but it doesn't hold the beep. It just well, it made me lie but I'm going to continue to try and show you. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and replace that. So what we have here is just the console, it comes off, and right here is your horn. So it's connected. We first want to make sure that the power is off and disconnect the battery before doing any electrical work. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Now that I have turned off the scooter and taken the battery out, it's safe to work on the unit. So what we're going to need to do is disconnect this wire harness here. And there's two screws to remove this. So what we're going to be replacing is essentially this part here. So this is a working part. This one here does not work. Let's go ahead and remove our screws. Looks like they're Phillips number three. Okay, this is the old buzzer, so I want to get this out of the way and not get it confused. You can tell the difference though, this one is a little bit, uh, get some debris on it. And we're going to go ahead and replace. The existing screws back in. that in place and then get that one set up too. I just went and grabbed the magnetic screwdriver. I lost the screw, so I had to retrieve it. So let's go ahead and get that back in position. Once that's screwed in, Okay, so once we have that screwed back in, just go ahead and connect your wire harness. We want to go ahead and put our batteries back in and do a function test. We're going to go ahead and turn the horn on. The scooter on, press the horn, and that is how you replace the horn 
on your mobility scooter. Now keep in mind, all mobility scooters are different, so the location of the buzzer will be in various locations. It could be under the scooter, it could be under the backside shroud of your scooter. So you might want to look in your user manual to determine where the buzzer is on your scooter so that you can replace or disconnect it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. We really hope you enjoyed this video and found it to be informative. And if you did like it, hit the thumbs up button at the end of the video. To stay up to date with our industry best content, make sure to click the red subscribe button. Check out our online store at mobilitydirect.com to view a plethora of products, specifications, videos, and more. As always, thank you for being you. Don't have a good day. Have a great day. We'll see you next time.